Well, Mouya, you are an international concert pianist who lives between Beijing and Paris. Welcome to the China Current. Let's begin with your childhood, because you started playing piano at the age of four. What memories do you have from that period? I was four years old. The first time he played piano, I remember that it was like a concert hall. 舞厅或者是酒吧一样的一个地方，我记得那是一次不太成功的表演，<笑>但是呢，让我非常非常的呃铭记在心。You are very different to other Chinese musicians because growing up as a student, you were exposed to、uh, different cultural traditions first in China and then, of course, in France, where you studied. Was there a fundamental difference, though, in their approach to music, whether it be interpretation or also to learning? The Chinese attitude to music is very, very much the same. It has very many similarities. When I was 14 years old, I had a very wonderful opportunity to come to France. The France I think is one of the world's centers of culture, at least one of the centers of culture. 但是我从，呃，整个西方人的眼睛中意识到了中国更有、更值得挖掘的很多很多的艺术和文化。关键我从法国，我看到了中国文化的影子。其实东西方的文化也是互相借鉴。那么中国永远都是一直都会有文化在孕育着。那么我觉得现在是个非常好的时机。中国现在也需要更多。呃，更经典的文化，好的东西都是世界的。两种文化既不同，但是所追求的品味都是都是一样，只不过时空是不同的，但是呢，又是相同。Your repertoire, your recordings include a wide range of composers, be they Chopin, Schumann, Schubert, or Debussy. But is there a particular period of work that you feel especially drawn to? 每一个能够我们叫起、叫上名来的作曲家，他都是在他那个时期代表着一个不同文化的一种象征，不同的一种精神的一种象征。因为这种精神是这么的丰富，呃，每一种都是互相的借鉴，但是又是那么的不同。好比说，我们是一个演员，在演不同的人、不同的角色，他是完全不一样，但是又是一样的。I'm James Chow. You're watching the China Current. Follow us on social media at the China Current.